Hey guys, it's Chase. And in this video, I just wanted to give you guys a small tour of the shop. Just another one to kind of just show you guys what I'm up to and uh, what's been going on for the holidays. So, um, without further ado, uh, these are two switch lights. Uh, they came in for new joysticks and then one of them needs a screen. Um, obviously we have the bench here. This is where I take apart stuff here. Um, game consoles, laptops, tablets, everything else. There's a bag right there that has some switch light stuff in it. That is a PS3 motherboard that I was pulling the Wi-Fi chip off of right there. Uh, got the quick hot air station there. Power supply. The oscilloscope. Tripod. The microscope. Fume extractor. Some solder and a mat. Some tools and various flux and alcohol. Bench multimeter. And then the paste soldering iron. Then we have my two monitors here for my PC that's down there. Um, it's kind of a mess, kind of crazy. Just got done with the work day. We had an Xbox One that came in that needed a disk drive and needed a full clean out, so we did that. Um, we had another switch light that came in earlier. I uh, needed a charging port and an M9 chip. And then we had an Xbox One S that came in that needed an HDMI connector. Um, where I pull parts from, I usually pull right here. I have them all labeled, or at least some of them. They're, these are not all the parts, but these are some of the common ones I use for HDMI. PS4 OG, uh, PS4 Slim, some PS5 ports, some uh, encoder chips for the P original PS4. You get the idea. And then the Xbox One stuff there. Um, and then a lot of my switch stuff is all right here. So we got various connectors, M9 fuel gauge, BQ, buttons, um, and then random like uh, micro USB ports and stuff like that for PS4 controllers and all sorts of stuff. Got lots of micro USB connectors there. Um, eventually I want to get those sorted out but I just haven't yet. Um, so this is basically a lot of where my parts are at too um, as we accumulate more uh, boards and stuff and go from there. Um, there's my fume extractor down there. That goes into that canister. By the way, thank you David. And it's just connected with some uh, electrical tape there. I just have it really nice and tight. It works. It's, uh, it's not bad. It works though. All right, so let's go into this room. This is what I wanted to show you guys for like the last week. So dad, um, his bench is kind of uh, a mess at the moment, but he has gotten himself the Northridge Fix microscope camera deal with the arm and all of that. So this thing is incredible, let me tell you. Um, I got to get myself one because right now I'm using this camera right here, the one you're looking at, looking through. Um, this camera is a Nikon D3500 and this is what I use right now for the microscope, but oh my goodness, dude, this camera is so good and so hilarious. This camera was a lot bigger in person than I thought it was. I mean, look at it compared to my aunt, it's huge. Um, and then we have this bench over here that we're gonna be working and we're gonna get this all cleaned up and then hopefully if my brother um, ends up deciding that he wants to do this as a full-time job, he will maybe eventually maybe be our big boss and by big boss I mean the guy that takes stuff apart, puts it back together, tests, diagnoses, all that. And if he wants to do micro soldering, this will be his bench. And then of course we just have this front counter here um, and stacks upon stacks of radios and CBs. Um, <laughs> this, this thing's pretty cool. It's a giant light up there. Shout out to uh, Fred, who actually made the little stand and that it actually works. I don't know, maybe we can get it to turn on. Uh, yes, there it is. Oh, dude, it's amazing. Uh, anyway, we'll shut that off. So yeah, this is it. This is the bench, this is everything. Um, so sometimes I come over here to Dad's bench if I've got to use uh, like a desoldering tool. He's got the pace uh, desoldering tool over there and the iron as well as his oscilloscope. Um, 
his service monitor, which is also hooked up to this screen here. Um, I mean, goodness, it's amazing. Incredible. Then we just have some random stuff over there, and that's pretty much it. Uh, the back room is kind of crazy right now, but of course, just like every shop, it is always a crazy, crazy experience. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this shorter video. Just wanted to get this out here just to show you guys what's going on and uh, just show you some updates with what's going on here at the shop. And if you guys have any questions about how I do something or have any recommendations, feel free to send them my way. I would appreciate that very much. Also, if you guys have anything that you would like me to fix, the shop address is down in the description and my contact info is down there as well. All right, guys. Will you guys take care? Have a Merry Christmas. And I'll see you guys in the next video.